As you see, I'm digging myself a deeper hole in my social class by yet again opening Pokemon cards. What's up, trashers? I'm back, and you know what? I'm wasting my life. I'll keep this short. The world of Pokemon is so cool, and yeah, they make those. I mean, look, they even have a show. Ryan Reynolds starring as some rundown smoker rat and seductive Pokemon. What more do you want? However, I want something tangible. Something to really let the magic settle in. I mean, I was gonna hire furries for this episode, but I already did that this week. Not in the sex way, though! Now that we got that out of the way, let's begin. Now, with the first pack, I didn't expect much. I mean, just look at this shroomish. He just looks so judgy. And he didn't look like much of a fun guy. Yeah, I went there, but boy was I wrong. See, for my last Pokemon card video, I wasn't expecting much because I'm not gonna lie, they were very mid, it wasn't anything special, so I wasn't expecting much when I was seeing Monkey, Arson Kid, Wedlock, Jojo's Duck, a literal alive tire, and Darwin's Theory in action. But when I saw that nest ball, <laughs> oh boy, I felt like a bird at the nest. See, what I did there is that it was kind of a pokey pun, like, you know, like a bird to the nest. And it was oh, like, what the pokey hell? Dude, this is a sick card, but this is probably where my luck ends. I I'm not gonna lie, I'm not that lucky. I'm just gonna ignore that I already have this card beforehand and take this as a win. I will admit that I did get the order wrong a lot and I started to get mad. Really mad. After I got that sorted out, I received a nightlight, a bad parent, the literal well of souls that you see in Hercules that never stops and will not stop for you. Time is forever marching and it will not stop for you. Yeah, he's pretty cool. And not your Libre. I actually really like that art. Is this my first time my voice is in without me being dubbed over? This is awesome. Okay, this is actually pretty cool art. This looks very professional. I actually do like this card a lot, despite what people think. Not in the sex way! Yo, this is so cool, dude! I'm actually kinda hyped now. Wait, wh what is this? I'm so lost for words, I had someone else do it for me. Oh my god! Dude! I leveled up! Boys, I think this is a good omen. Honestly, I was excited after opening all these cards, thinking I actually think I have good luck for once. And people always think three is lucky. I mean, hey, I have three kids too, so I mean, it, it's a no-brainer. And as soon as I opened it, it was fire. Like, actual fire. I, I felt it, and it felt like I was actually in hell. And, oh, a person. Lame. Not gonna lie. The cards were really weak, and then I got another full art of a mid Pokemon. I mean, I, okay, I don't hate cast form, but honestly, there's too much speculation about what cast form is for me to even try talking about it. I will say, though, I am a Gen 5 boy, so when I saw Charon on that card, I actually felt like I was at home. I was actually completely fine with this pack, and then... Ah! Um, wait a frickin' Bidoofin' mi <laughs> Um... Wait a freaking Bidoofin minute here. When did Satan join the damn Discord server? Wait, what pack was this? Oh my god, I got the cover art. <laughs> oh my god, that's sick. Dude, I was kidding about the hell skit. I didn't realize it was an actual ritual. I guess this makes me a Satanist now. What is up with my luck today, dude? I got the literal devil. With a god sleeve. <laughs> um, I feel really wrong putting this in a card slot that has God on it, and I'm putting Satan in it. But you know what? Life goes on. Now, time for the fourth and last one. This one should be good. First, we got a phoenix. This is good. A bird cloud thingy. This is good. A person. This sucks now. Anyway, after that, we got a dumbbell. A weird bugger thing. COVID-19. A literal alien. Oh. Hi, Nine, COVID-20, and... You've got to be kidding me. Listen, I'm not upset, but I got duped yet again. I mean, it's not that I don't like the card, but wouldn't you be upset if, like, you already had a 2011 
Toyota Corolla, and then your parents are like, oh, look, we got you a second car, and it turns out to be a 2010 Toyota Corolla. I mean, I don't know, since I don't have two cars, but I feel like that same person has the same, like, reaction to this. Well, this was a good load, and I am overly satisfied with what I got. Thank you guys for watching, and catch you guys next time. You know I don't end videos like that. Yeah, I thought I needed to one-up that last video, so I got this. Well, with four more packs to open, let's get opening. I guess I got nothing else but my life to ruin ahead of me. With the first ten pack, I didn't really think that the cards were all that great, except this one. <laughs> the lost Roomba of the legends. Oh my god, I finally found it. It was underneath the couch. Coofins. Coofins? Cushions? I may have a con 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 Yeah, <laughs> I need to get that checked out soon. Oh, and I got this Eevee. Moving on. I actually kind of like this Eevee. I mean, if you don't know me, I actually do really like cute Pokemon. So seeing this Pokemon kind of like uplifted my spirits a little bit. I mean, I'm thinking, oh, my luck is still going. This is great. I like Eevee. This is a cool packet. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> what the? Dude, I don't know what this gloom is on, but I need it now. Is this the thing that Monokuma uses? Whatever. Not a lot of people think to play that game anyway. Beware, this thing's about to skibbity bop all the way over to your mom's house. What are you doing, little boy? Let me escort you to the nearest Kmart around. There you'll find coupons in the trash can. And lots of Cheaply made donuts. Mm, my favorite. God, I need to get off the internet fast. Then I got a cute cat. Aw, I'm gonna name you Jambo. And a signed card by a fictional character. You made me realize I wasted money on this. Come on, just, just get the damn fuck out. Just get it. Get, get the damn fuck over it. They say I have kids. Third time's the charm! Uh, yeah, no, this one was a bust. I didn't even get a hollow. Worst monkey I ever got. Now, this is the last pack. I have to end off great, otherwise I can't use the Vine Boom MP3. Oh, great. I got the Forbidden My Little Pony character. Oh, wait, what's this? Wait, wait, it's a, it's a, it's a good card, oh my god! What the? Now that I opened all these cards, it reminded me of the magic the series would dawn on me as a kid. I know a lot of people don't like the Pokemon franchise out there, and rightfully so. I mean, they were literally called the Pocket Monsters whenever people would contest about how horrible Pokemon cards were. And they were also told that they taught us about gambling. Excuse me? When? And one day, Pokemon may lose its touch on me. I mean, it is a series just for kids. But it's also just more than that. Pokemon is a series that I was able to enjoy as a kid and not think about other problems in the world and just play the game or just open up more packs and compare it with friends. For right now, Pokemon is right where it needs to be as my treasured childhood. But who said I couldn't enjoy it as an adult? <laughs>